welcome to Legal Basics with Sarah Lo Global and my name is Sian. Today we discuss a form of intellectual property, which is industrial designs. Let's start with an example. If you found a bottle of Fanta without the writing that says it is Fanta, would you know that it is Fanta? I would. And do you know how I would know that it is Fanta? Because of the shape, because it is unique, because no other drink comes in a Fanta looking bottle or a Coca-Cola looking bottle or a Sprite looking bottle. Now, industrial designs refer to the shape, configuration or ornamental aspects of three-dimensional objects. Just like patents, Industrial designs have to be novel and they have to meet the requirement for industrial appli application for them to be protected. Other than that, industrial designs have to be appealing to the eyes and they have to be unique such that it distinguishes the products from others in the same industry. Now, Industrial designs in Kenya can only be protected for two terms of five years each. The first term of five years, which is renewable, for another term of five years. After the lapse of ten years, industrial designs can no longer be protected. Now, industrial designs cannot be about aspects that are protected under trademark and it cannot be aspects that are protected under copyright. So before you decide to protect a shape or a configuration or a pattern or a form of a product for it to be distinguishable in the market, you have to ensure that the aspect that you want to protect is not protected under copyright and you have to ensure that it's not protected as a trademark. I hope this broadcast has been useful to you. Please write to us with your questions at sarahloglobal at gmail.com. We will be happy to answer you. Take care of yourself and stay safe. Bye-bye.